everyone. Um, welcome to Automate G Suite with App Script and Angular. My name is Grant Timmerman, and I'm a developer platform engineer at Google. Um, so I work at Google in San Francisco, uh, where I work on G Suite developer products. Today, I'm really excited to teach you how you can leverage Google App Script and Angular to quickly build powerful applications. These are some of the G Suite products that I work on. But first, uh, let's take a selfie. Right? Uh, this means uh, zi pai. This is uh, Chinese for selfie. Great. I don't know if I can get everyone, but let's try. If my camera app loads. Uh, three, two, one. No, okay, I definitely need to upgrade my iPhone to an Android phone. <laughs> um, just, really? Are you serious? Okay. Uh, that would be lovely. Yeah. Could we get a selfie? It's already set up. Oh, great. <laughs> okay, I don't know if I can get everyone, but let's try. The other crowd. Woo! Great. Thank you so much. You're so welcome. And my camera app is still not working. OK. Uh, so before we begin, uh, let me give some introductions. First, uh, G Suite is the set of collaboration and productivity tools within Google Cloud. So you can see uh, Google Cloud includes everything from Google Cloud Platform, G Suite, Max Maps Platform, Chrome Enterprise, and Android Enterprise. Today, I'm going to be focusing on G Suite. So G Suite includes everything from Gmail, uh, Drive, Google Calendar, as well as our editors, Docs, Sheets, Slides, and Forms, and our administrative tools, the Admin SDK, and Google Classroom for EDU. AppScript provides a layer of abstraction we're integrating Google APIs from Gmail to Google Calendar. Angular provides a complete client-side solution for web applications. Together, I believe with AppScript and Angular, you can build powerful web applications to automate tasks in minutes. But these cool things don't really matter if you can't meet users where they are. Today, I want to show you how you can build add-ons with Angular and App Script within Google Sheets. For a high level, we'll be using the following. First, uh, Google Cloud will host our application and our server-side co code. Uh, App Script will be our uh, backend service that will interact with Google Sheets as well as other APIs. <coughs> Angular will be used for our front-end web, web components. Uh, this tool called Clasp will, uh, is the App Script CLI, and it'll allow us to use TypeScript. Um, and we'll also use uh, some other tools like Stack Driver Logging within Google, uh, the YouTube API, uh, Gmail's API, and even GitHub. With App Script, you have Legos. You can build it incredible. It's really up to whatever your mind is the limit. So let me show you a demo in action. Cool. Can you all see the sheets? Great. So here I have a Google Sheet. Um, it has actually the list of speakers for uh, this year's event. Um, you can see we have the name, the Twitter, session type, or speaker type, uh, talk title, bio, et cetera. And this is great, uh, but it's only a static uh, tabular set of data. Um, how can we add some interactivity with it? Well, with uh, Google Apps Script, we can uh, add side menus. So here I've created a little button which will pop out the side menu. So 
uh, we'll actually see that um, on the right-hand side, we'll see contextual information, uh, the GitHub profile uh, photo, um, and other information about uh, specific users that we're highlighting. Um, we'll actually even get the, uh, get the top result from the YouTube API and show it right here in the side panel. So, uh, how does that work? Let's show um, some of the code. So, uh, first, uh, let me show you uh, this tool called Clasp. Um, Clasp it stands for the command line app script project tool. Um, it allows you to upload projects, download projects, et cetera. Um, so here I have uh, some sample code. Um, and here I'm just uh, declaring a function called sendmail. And we're uh, saying uh, in the first line, gmail app.sendmail. Uh, this uses the Google uh, Gmail API. And uh, in one line of code, we can send an email. So let's actually uh, try to do this right now. Um, so. So. Cool. Um. Cool, so what, is, what this is doing in the background is we're actually, uh, we have a node binary here called clasp, and we're communicating to the app script API, uh, which then uh, makes a request to uh, Gmail's API to send an email. Um, and if that's all successful, we should see an email uh, sent to Jules and Keith, the PM of app script. So, well, uh, so we've just sent an email um, just zero minutes ago. Uh, we can also do other things like, uh, for example, uh, searching YouTube videos. So let's say I uh, am doing some analytics and would like to search for the top 10 YouTube results uh, pro pro programmatically uh, of the query Angular Connect. Well, from AppScript, we can do that pretty easily. Um, so for example, we can just search uh, top YouTube videos here. Uh, let me first run the demo. And we can see uh, we have a list of the top 10 YouTube videos. Just to confirm, here we see, uh, that's actually me. <laughs> that's quite funny. <laughs> um, wow, what are the odds? Um, OK. <laughs> uh, so uh, just to explain the code a little bit, um, here we're declaring a function. Um, and we declare our videos. Uh, and we search for specifically the ID and the snippet of our YouTube uh, videos. We provide the query Angular Connect, uh, the type of video instead of a playlist, for example. And then we just want 10 results. Um, and then for each of these items, uh, we just log the output. And so uh, this is actually uh, what's the same function that's populating this uh, little dialog flow, except uh, in this one, we're just getting one result. Um, 
would be great if uh, Jules and Keith were around. Uh, but no worries. Um, so in summary, um, I showed you how you can uh, use Google Sheets and you can create uh, custom side menus um, in the 300 pixels on the side of Google Sheets. And you can uh, build a custom web application that can connect to APIs like uh, YouTube's API, GitHub's API, et cetera. Um, so you can uh, select whichever uh, road you'd like and you'll get uh, live results on the right-hand sidebar. Um, the beauty about this is that you don't need to worry about uh, hosting any of your code. It all lives within Google Cloud, and any user that uh, has access to the spreadsheet has access to your application. Um, so we integrated with uh, GitHub, Gmail, and Google Sheets, as well as uh, YouTube's API really quickly. Um, so one of the advantages of AppScript is that you're able to write uh, API calls like this without having to worry about any OAuth or uh, server-side credentials. Um, it's, uh, OAuth is built into AppScript, and so you, you don't need to worry about uh, managing if your application has authenticated with this API or not. Here we're just searching for a snippet and getting the videos back. And then, I actually haven't shown this part. So uh, let's say you'd like um, you'd like to convert this file into TypeScript, right? Um, and run it on Google Apps Script servers. Well, so to do that, uh, there's simply two things. One is you uh, rename your file from .ts to .js, and then you'll see uh, there's some um, errors. To fix that, we can simply go just install the types from npm. Great. And well, this, this variable should be in a different file, so it should resolve. Um, And when we actually push to the server, uh, we're going to be transpiling um, the uh, TypeScript into Google Apps Script. Um, and so we could uh, Im immediately evoke, invoke the function. So let me just run the send mail function again, and hopefully, uh, okay, uh, hopefully things will work, but maybe not. Okay. Cool. And to uh, just use uh, TypeScript with uh, Google Apps Script, all you have to do is uh, import Google Apps Script in the beginning, and then you can get all this auto completion. For example, uh, sending emails um, is really quite uh, simple with Apps Script. And uh, once you are able to uh, send emails, you can actually, uh, so you can execute uh, commands from the, uh, functions from the command line, um, and even view Stackdriver logs. Ideally, we would have woke uh, Jules and Keith. Um, they're uh, in US Pacific. Um, so that's it. Uh, that's Automate G Suite with Apps Script and Angular. Um, my name is Grant Timmerman. Um, feel free to ask me any questions, but thank you so much.